Hello everyone, and I hope you're doing great today. Now today we're continuing with our nuclear reaction decay examples. To see other nuclear reaction examples, you can check out the lessons attached at the end screen, or you can scroll through the radioactive slash nuclear reaction playlist. Now today's focus is on the neutron decay. Now a neutron is a neutrally charged subatomic particle. It has no proton and a mass of one. For the first two examples, we're looking at the emission of neutron. The first question reads, which element is formed when radon-222 disintegrate by emitting a neutron? Now, radon proton number is 86. It emits a neutron. Therefore, to find the new element, what you're going to do is to take away 1 from 222. Therefore, the new mass is 221. Taking away 0 from the proton number gives us the same proton number, so therefore the new element is still radon. However, the mass number is 221, so therefore the answer is radon 221. Now for our second example, what we're going to do here is so which element, when emits a neutron, produces carbon-14 and astatine-212. Now astatine, carbon, and the neutron, they are products. So our neutron is represented, carbon-14 with a proton number of 6, and also acetine with a proton number of 85. Now the element that was used to form these products, what you're going to do is to first find the mass by adding all the masses on the product side. So as a result, what do we get there is 227. For the proton number, adding all the protons, what you're going to get there is 91. Therefore, the element is protactinium. So the answer is protactinium-227. For our final example, we're looking at an absorption of a neutron. The question reads, which element is formed when casium-134 absorbs a neutron? Now, casium has a proton number of 55. Absorbing a neutron... What you're going to do now to get the resulting element is to add the mass numbers, and so therefore we get 135. 0 to 55 is still 55, so therefore the new element is casium. However, it is casium 135. All right, so I want to thank you for watching this lesson, and I truly appreciate you, and I want to remind you, whether you lose or gain, be happy. Have a blessed and wonderful day. Talk to you soon.